Hey everybody, your host AMF1534 here. Let's play some more Skyroads. So, uh, we're doing the Crab Nebula. You'll notice that there's three dots there, and, uh, well, I'll tell you a backstory about it. I was actually trying to do this last night, and for whatever reason, my computer, like, I recorded the video, but it just, like, mysteriously didn't record it at all, and so... I ended up actually in the video. I ended up beating three levels, but it didn't re it didn't save any of the recording that I did. So I'm kind of pissed about that. So we'll see. Maybe if we can get it to work properly this time, but it's probably not going to happen just because it's not. It's me. Why would I have that kind of luck? God, this song is insanely erratic for like no reason. Like, oh my god, this level's really hard. What the fuck? Uh oh. Uh-oh. Yeah! God, that part's so hard. It's like the longest jump that I'll ever have to make ever. Just wait till you see the next level, though. You're gonna just be like, holy shit, what the... What in the Great Gatsby's Ghost is this all about? So I made a... And for those of you that didn't know, I uh, didn't get a video up partially because of my recording issue, but also because I was actually... Um, taking part in helping a friend of mine make a music video. He's he's a rapper. You can find him on uh, on YouTube. His name is he goes by Matty Three. Um, but I'm not here to plug all of his stuff right now. Oh my God! But yeah, I had to get up at uh, eight in the morning to be there. Oh shit! Oh no! Okay. Oh my God! Hold on. I just I need to concentrate on this first. This is a little too intense for me to try to do otherwise. Okay, there we go. So we had to get up at 8 in the morning. Supposed to be wherever we were supposed to be by, uh, like, 9.30. And we were we got there at, like, 9.45, so we're like, oh my god, we're going to be late. Ended up being that we actually had to sit outside for two and a half hours before everybody showed up when they were supposed to. It's just like, what the fuck, dude? And it was, it was freezing. Like, it was... It was colder than like a witch's tit out there. And it was just like not tight whatsoever. I was like, dude, what the fuck? Where is this guy? And it turns out that the guy actually did show up on time that we were waiting for it, but he like he went to like the wrong block that was like a third of a block from where we were at and he said he didn't see anybody. When in fact we were there the whole time. We could have started on time instead of me freezing my freaking cock off. But no. And so we, we filmed for about eight hours. And at that point, I was just exhausted. I didn't even feel like doing anything last night after a certain point. I wonder if we're going to make this. This would be amazing if we did. Nice. I'm actually doing rather well right now. That's probably because I partially know this level. In case you're wondering why I wasn't jumping at all, it's because the gravity was 1700 and it actually didn't allow you to jump, so you just had to move. It was ridiculous. Anywho. So yeah, I actually wasn't in the video like I initially said I was going to be. I actually did not end up making a cameo, but I'm I'm okay I'm okay with that. I actually I was doing a lot of behind the scenes filming and stuff. It was it was pretty cool. Um, it'll get you guys. I'll probably post a link to the video sometime in the future. Um, the name of the video is called Blast Off. It's actually pretty tight. It's got some uh, rappers from like uh, Portland and Seattle, which are up in Washington. Well, Portland's in Oregon, I'm sorry. Seattle's in Washington. And uh, Maddie's from Salem. And so, yeah, good stuff. But I'm not, I'm not here to do all the plugging for his stuff. This is, this is my show. My show. Where my stuff happens. Let's see. This, this level, this one, when I was making my video last night, before it totally just decided to not work, this level was hard. Like, I, I could not figure this out for the life of me, and I'm still having an issue with it now. Because they put these slippery squares here, and it's just a real, real piece of dog shit. Oh, that was stupid. What the hell? Where'd I go? Oh, there must be a hole there. And the All-Star game's on right now, but I'm not watching it, because it actually hasn't started yet. God damn it. I hate that. I hate that spot. I hate the fact that they put a slippery square right before you're allowed to move. It makes that move so much harder. Okay, here we go. Uh, excuse me. Alright, so we're gonna jump up here. Or we're not, because I just can't do it. 
<laughs> so, um, another thing, actually, before I think about it, one of my... Yeah. Come on, Adam. God, Jesus. Um, one of my viewers, um, I'm sure if you guys actually went to my profile right now, you would find it, but um, he actually thought that I was a stoner. <laughs> Probably partially because of my my constant nonchalant demeanor. But uh, just to dismiss that, I am I am not a stoner, I promise you. I, I, I do not join the green team often. This part's really, really hard, by the way. And you'll, you'll see why here in just a minute. It's actually not as bad as I'm probably going to make it out to be, because if you just stay in the middle, you're probably going to make it. This is what makes it hard. You just gotta not kill yourself, because I definitely killed myself right here once. Yeah, this part's really hard to get through, because you can't move, and you just have to keep jumping, and it's annoying. But we got it. Good shit. But yeah, I'm definitely not a stoner at all. But then again, a lot of people in Oregon are, so I can kind of see where that kind of, like where that idea would come from because a lot of people from Oregon, especially Eugene, are definitely a lot of potheads but I am not one of them and now, oh boy we're over the base, apparently whatever that's supposed to entail oh my god this is definitely a point where I have not seen yet, so this could get this would get pretty nasty soon, I'm, I'm sure oh boy at least we have regular gravity I don't know what my cat's doing under my desk but I'm sure it's probably nothing productive. If he rips any of the cords out of my computer, I swear I'm going to lynch him in the worst fashion possible. Oh, my... <sighs> Another thing, too. I have a story. This is one of those stories about my job and things that happen in the health food industry occasionally. So, we had a customer... Wow, that part's going to be weird. We had a customer call on the phone asking if the boss was there. We're like, well, no, he's not here on the weekend, so can we help you with anything? She's like, well, I just I wanted to ask something. I I took this this product and uh, it's supposed to like be good for your for like uh you know promoting regularity so that I can you know have regular bowel movements and stuff. She's like, but for whatever reason, it was giving me like crazy nightmares and things. What the hell? Cat, what are you doing? My cat's like adhered to the door. It's weird. Oh well, whatever. Let him get stuck in there. Anyway, she was saying that this product that's supposed to like, it's pretty much like a laxative. We'll, we'll just, you know, not beat her on the bush. She was saying that it gave her vivid nightmares. Vivid diarrhea-related nightmares. It's like, okay. And I need to know this for what reason? Oh shit, that was stupid. I'm an idiot. I'm a literal idiot. I'm literally lacking things in my brain that would make me have not made that decision prior to doing it. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Alright. Oh no! Wow! That, I mean, even though I ended up dying, that was like a super clutch jump. Even though it ended up being my complete and utter demise. But yeah. Diarrhea-induced nightmares. She's like, and I tried going on Google searching for diarrhea-induced nightmares, and I couldn't find anything. <laughs> I'm just like, boy, I wonder why. Do you think people get diarrhea-induced nightmares often? I don't think so, ma'am. Maybe you have some type of issue that's a little bit deeper than thinking that you're having nightmares because you can't crap. You can't shit your soul out. Okay, I need to sneeze, oh my god. <laughs> oh god, that hurts so bad. Ugh. And that was also the cause of why I just died. <clears throat> I couldn't see. I think that it's, I, I don't know if it's a fact or not, but is it like literally impossible for people to sneeze with their eyes open? I don't feel like I've ever experienced nor heard of anybody that's been able to sneeze with their eyes open. And I've also heard that it, actually your heart stops when you when you sneeze. I don't know if that's true or not, but I've I've heard of it. It's probably just like one of those things that just totally aren't real at all. Am I like almost at the end of this or what? Oh, supplies! Y no! God damn it all! That right down to hell, just straight into hell. VIP pass to hell even. First class ticket. Oh, man. Here we go. Let's do it. This is a... Uh, 
that jump is really, really unorthodox. Well, actually, no, it's perfectly orthodox, I'm sorry. It's just I can't make it, so I'm trying to make up an excuse for why I can't do it. Leave it to me to make excuses for why I can't do things. God damn it. Just a load of horse shit. Okay, here we go. I would love to be able to make this, but I... God, that's happened twice now. Consecutively. Indubitably. Let's see if... I'm just not going to say anything for that one. That was just... That was just stupid. Purely, purely dumb. By the way, we're getting very close to um, my console-related LPs to be starting. I'm going to have to do a couple of uh, test runs to make sure all my software works properly. And then after that, we'll, uh, we'll get down to it. Down to the nitty-gritty. So, yeah. You guys better watch out for that. AMF's moving up in the world of gaming. <clears throat> P.S. I'm just... I'm really having a big problem with this section all of a sudden. But that seems to be what happens in games for some reason. You get to a point where you're doing really, really good, and then you, like, fuck up once, and then you're just, like, your... Your self-esteem for that just totally goes down the shitter. Because you just feel like you can't do it anymore. Okay, there's one of them. Get too crazy, don't get too crazy. Okay, here's our supplies section. God damn it! Son of a biscuit eating hoe bag putting I don't know, something inside of something involving spitting on an asshole, I don't know. God, that's really gross. I was just throwing words out there. That's absolutely horrifyingly terribly gross. I directly, directly apologize for that, because that's just horrid. If I could, like, hit a rewind button for that, I would do it. Um, okay. I would love to get done with this, because I feel like we're not far. I mean, I wasn't far away from getting through this. Unfortunately, I'm just struggling, is all. Here we go. Maybe we can get it now. I just have to take things slowly. Slowly but surely. I don't know why, but for whatever reason, that song just reminded me, or that makeshift song I made up in my brain just reminded me of Oh Sherry by, I think it's like Steve Perry. It was awesome. I love that song. Oh Sherry. Something, something. Yeah. You know what song it is. There's no way nobody hasn't heard of that song before. Unless you haven't, then you haven't, obviously. <clears throat> I love that song. Okay, let's just uh, get through this. I feel like it's possible, but I'm just... God damn it! It feels like he's like... It feels like the ship's just like hanging up there too long. It's pissing me off. Like, I feel like I'm jumping at the exact same time that I am on the previous section. It's just not doing anything. It's like literally like causing me to do that. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. God! Okay. I'm going to try one more time at this, just one more, before I get, essentially call it quits today, because my frustration levels are building, though I'm not going to make that the reason for why I would stop playing today, god damn it, I'm taking one more. I'm just almost out of time, I've been doing this level for about a solid, uh, about seven minutes I think, and that usually is more than my normal time spent for these, unless it was, uh, I don't remember what level it was, but I think I spent, like, a, about 23 minutes on that one. That one was, that one was crappy. I did not enjoy that level at all. Which I don't remember what, what part that was in. I think it was in part three. God, why can't I make that jump? It's so stupid. I don't get it. I can make the first one just fine, but no, no, not that one. Why would anybody want to make that jump? Nobody. 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 Here we go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Nope. Okay. That's pretty much just going to be the tale of the tape today. It's called Adam Can't Do Things. So, 
When we come back on the next episode of Let's Play Sky Roads, we're going to try to get through Road 1. And I hope to God that Road 2 and 3 aren't harder than that, but why wouldn't they be? It's harder. It's further on in the game and things get harder. So, whatever. This is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. You have a good one. Goodbye.